So we finally got our first anime preview of My Hero Academia. I've been waiting for this for a long time. And this finally we got to see what actually the show is going to actually look like animated. We actually got to hear the actual anime voice actors for both like Deku and also as well with All Might as well. And I got to say I am very impressed so far of who they've got as voice actors. So like literally it's what I expected for what we was going to get. Honestly the Deku I was kind of expecting kind of that little... If, honestly, I was expecting some voice like he now would be a great one to voice him, but turns out that the actual person that we get to uh, actually hear him from it is uh, Daiki Yamashita. I probably butchered that as far. And as much, even though I've only seen a couple of episodes of the series, he is the main character of the uh, Yomushi Pedal. I think his name was Onada, like uh, I believe. So I was expecting, yeah, that kind of like that because Deku at the start of the series is kind of like a little bit of the whine, you know, like kind of whiny, kind of like nervous character. Although he grows incredibly fast throughout the series, like that. I way much enjoy Deku much to Onada. I have other thing like two episodes of Yomushi Pedal, so I don't know if he grows even more. But it's like honestly, yeah, like that's honestly crazy. And one of the shocking to see is that the the guy that they got to do like all might uh kenta miyaki is the one that does abdul in jojo uh, bizarre adventure stardust crusaders so that's a weird role honestly to have him as well honestly i was not expecting that and for all we saw the animation bones looks like it's doing an absolute fantastic job with it i mean i know it's only a small clip it uh, so you know anything could look good in like a couple of seconds and all that but from what we saw we got to see deku going in doing a massive detroit punch we got to see all might as well so all i can say is like people that have been really wanting to check uh, like academia for a while i honestly bones they've got a good track record they haven't done a single anime that i don't like well apart from like the series like uh, Solia not really but that's mainly the actual story's material quality whenever they're actually handling something with something you know good quality like Soul Eater Blood Bouquet Battlefront we are in good hands trust me so I am very much looking forward to this expect and, like if there's more previews I definitely want to see who they've got for like some of the other characters later on like especially they need to get Bakugo right for me that's my favorite character Todoroki as well people know so I'm really looking forward to talking about, like, you know, like, I want to see the latest chapter, man. Like, come on, like, but obviously we'll talk about the chapters in those manga videos because I know some of you are going to be anime-only watchers. So, honestly, let me know what you think in the comments down below, what you thought about this My Hero Academia preview. I'm really excited to watch the anime. I mean, I know it's going to be a great replacement for when One Punch Man ends. And I'll, honestly, I just want a confirmation. Is it going to be 24 episodes or is it going to be 12 episodes? At the moment, we've got about, like, only a few couple of uh, like chapters out there so i'm expecting 24 is pushing it but i definitely think we can get 24 episodes like in that series but let me know the questions down below but that's all for me so i'll catch you guys next time